welcome and welcome back to my channel. It is currently May 5th, Cinco de Mayo. I wanted to do a vlog for a couple days before I leave for the Philippines. I'm leaving in about a week. I have an appointment for teeth whitening and um, I'm really excited. Right now I'm just putting on moisturizer. I just washed my face. I used the um, Fenty Beauty Visor SPF. I actually can't believe we're leaving in like a week. When I first booked the um, flight, it was about like 82 days left. Yes, I was counting down because I was so excited. If you don't know me, um, then you don't know that I'm actually from the Philippines. And um, I haven't been there in about eight years, so I'm really excited. And I get to see all my friends that I haven't seen in so long. I've been trying not to wash my hair that often because I usually actually wash it like every day. It strips off like your natural hair oils and uh, leaves your hair like really dull and dry. So I'm trying not to wash it that often, but I have straight hair and straight hair gets oily really easily even though you don't like work out or anything. So I'm using this uh, Batiste dry shampoo and it's been saving my life honestly. And I haven't washed my hair in three days and I'm super proud of myself because I usually can't resist washing my hair when it feels really oily. So yeah, I'm gonna try not to wash my hair every freaking day. Just gonna spray a little uh, Tatcha Luminous Dewy Skin Mist. Literally, this thing makes my face look so like dewy and um, like highlighted already and it just makes my overall like face just like prettier I guess but I swear like whenever I wear this on my face those are the days that I get compliments on like my face This is the fit. These pants are from White Fox Boutique and the top is from Garage. Yeah, I'm on my way to my teeth whitening. I just finished uh, teeth whitening and looks really good um, honestly and I went two shades up which is pretty good for me because I was already like on the whiter side of um, shade I actually drove to uh, Pacific City it's like a little shopping mall here in Huntington Beach and I'm gonna go to a couple stores real quick and grab something before my third appointment I have a little um, stomach sculpting appointment at 3 but I'm gonna go grab a couple of things from Brandy Melville and maybe another store and yeah but yeah going to Brandy Melville shopping I went to Brandy Melville and Sephora and um, I'm filming on my iPhone now because my uh, camera died <laughs> now I'm on my way to my M sculpt appointment and I'll take you guys there with me Like little 
toning your stomach and to getting abs and things like that. But it's basically like crunches and sit up, but just like maybe like 30,000 of them or 10,000 of them per session. And, and I've had it done before and I love it because it tones my stomach, especially for those people who are already fatigued. It works really well and when you're building like your abs, especially if you don't like working out your abs, this is a really good investment. I just got Starbucks uh, right here. The drive through line was literally like wrapped around the building. It was so long. And then, so I decided to go inside like in the actual store. No line, no wait, ordered right away. Got my drink in like two minutes. She just went to take my order and went to go make it. If you're in a hurry in the morning, don't go through drive through Go inside the store. It'll be way faster, but yeah. Moral of the story, don't go to drive throughs There you go, little hack for you guys. Also, side note, I know uh, ordering through the app must be like the fastest way, but they don't have everything on their menu on the app. Yeah, um, for example, they don't have oat milk on there. Yeah, that's all I have to say. Hey, finally home. And I wanted to do a quick little um, haul for you guys for what I got. I was supposed to only do um, an M sculpt for my stomach because I had an appointment at 10 a.m., but I couldn't resist and I went to Ulta searching for the um, Chanel hand cream and um, I know it's all hype and $50 for one like hand cream is a little bit too much but I give in to the hype. I also wanted to buy it for my mom for Mother's Day so bought a couple things from Ulta and I want to show you guys. I went to two different Ulta's. It wasn't fun. I had to drive like three different places two of them was Ulta and then one was the mall to like look for this hand cream and they were all sold out but luckily there was one store near me that had it and it was kind of like a slower Ulta so I think they um, not a lot of people thought not a lot of people think they have like Chanel products in there so um, yeah I also I'm gonna do a haul from what I got today and what I got yesterday from yesterday's vlog so I'm gonna start with yesterday's vlog. I went to Sephora. For myself, I got the Way um, Wave Spray. This is supposed to give your hair like natural waves. There's a tiny bit of waves in there, but I think that's like my normal hair. And I think I was in the right place and at the right time when I went to Sephora because they were giving out free little hourglass translucent powder um, samples, or I think well, the guy was just like, here, here's a free, um, here's a gift from us, um, our glass translucent powder, the travel size. And I was just like, these are pretty expensive, like, when you get them as a mini. And I have the big one of this, and I was almost out. Thank God I was there at the right time because they were giving these out. And another thing I got for my seal is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Freeze. This is supposed to give you the feathered brows, um, laminated brows. I also got the, from today's trip to Ulta, I got the um, Brow Freeze Dual Ended Brow Styling Wax Applicator. I saw somebody using this on YouTube and the results looked pretty good and I just thought maybe I should try it out. Another thing I got from Ulta from today's trip, I got the Hourglass um, Brush, Foundation Brush. I've been struggling with like finding um, foundation brushes for a long time. And the only one I've liked uh, is the Artis, Artis brush, the super dense one, the one that low-key looks like a toothbrush. But um, that, I feel like when I wipe it on my skin, it kind of drags the makeup away, not like spread it well. 
but it kind of takes the makeup off and, it, and the brush just absorbs it. So I got this hourglass uh, brush and I hope it just, I hope it turns out like fine. But this is what, I'm not gonna open it because I'm not gonna use it yet. Put that back. And I got a little uh, micellar um, cleansing water because uh, I use this, I use this all the time. I just need a travel size one for my trip. And then my favorite part of this haul is that I got, I went to two different Ulta's, one Chanel store in the mall, and I finally found it at the last Ulta that I was gonna visit. And I said, if it wasn't gonna be here, I give up. And I found it, and I got the last two. I got the Chanel cream, um, hand creams, and um, these are expensive as hell. These are $50 each, but I wanted to buy my mom one and I just wanted to buy myself one. This is for Mother's Day. I know she's gonna love it, so can't wait to give it to her. I'm actually gonna go meet her in the Philippines. She's in the Philippines right now. And I'm gonna meet her when I get there. So I'm gonna give this here once I see her. And another thing from Chanel that I got is, um, I meant from Ulta, but in the Chanel section, I got the CC cream because um, this is this has also SPF and I don't want to wear like heavy foundation in the Philippines so um, hopefully this is good because it also has like anti-aging properties that when you use it like um, consistently like it actually is really good for your skin in the long run you know like not just like foundation where you just put it on and it's just you put it on but no benefits to it in the long run but this one, um, your skin gets better and better as you use it because of all the um, vitamins and stuff. Um, and it's good for when you're in the sun because it protects your skin from skin damage. So excited to use that. And another thing is I went to Brandy Melville and I got a dress. So it's just this little dress. A regular, like literally like a tank top and just like a, a dress. I think this would look cute in like some beige socks and then my Balenciaga shoes but yeah that's what I got from today and yesterday hey you guys so um, I'm home now and um, I wanted to show you guys my uh, Gucci purchase I came home from uh, charging my car I came home from uh, going to the bank now that's all done I'm gonna show you guys um, my little Gucci purchase. It is the Gucci Women's Original GG Slide Sandals. It's in the color uh, beige and um, I can't wait to show you guys because it's super, 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 super cute. But it comes in this box right here, um, uh, delivered by FedEx. And it's a pretty big box actually. I'm gonna open this. All right. My boyfriend literally doesn't trust me with a knife and I don't know if I do either, but... Um, <laughs> Bruh. Oh, there you go. I am an idiot for that. So, oh my god, it's so pretty. Right as you open it, it has this, um, the box actually comes with like a print right here. Oh my god, it's so pretty. Comes with a little Gucci letter with a Gucci um, envelope. Oh my God, I am so impressed by this packaging. Like this is like one of the best packaging I've ever seen. Whoa, okay, I gotta take pictures real quick. I like don't ever wanna ruin this packaging because it's just so cute. I don't even wanna open it. I am so, 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 so impressed. Like I've never, I guess because I have never bought Gucci, but this is so amazing. Like, okay, so here's an envelope. Thank you for shopping with us at Gucci. And this is like my, one of my favorite parts. It comes with a tote bag. I didn't know that. It comes with a tote bag. That is so awesome. Okay. Now, <laughs> this is the box. Super cute packaging, like always, or like I've said. And yeah, it feels like Christmassy right now. I feel like I'm, I feel like someone gifted this to me as a present. This is what it 
it looks like inside. It has a little pamphlet and then another pamphlet. I'll read those later or maybe never. <gasps> comes in these little shoe bags. Pretty cute because it comes like one and one, like separately. That's, I love that. <gasps> Look at that. So pretty. Oh my gosh, it's so like, it's like medium um, weight. It's not too heavy, but if, when I try it on, I'll let you guys know. Let me show you guys up close first of what it looks like. This is what it looks like. I chose this print because I felt like the other ones were like a bit hard to like match with. Um, I felt like this is the most neutral looking one where I can match it with a bunch of stuff. Classic Gucci logo right there. And it feels very um, good quality fabric on it. Now time to try it on. Oh my God, it's perfect. I am so in love. Oh my gosh. It's like super perfect, like not too tight on your um, feet and not too wide and not too loose. It's just the perfect amount and it's platform. It makes me taller. If you know me, I am uh, five foot. I am like so happy I got these shoes because they look so good and they fit my feet so well and I have like wider feet and this was perfect. It wasn't even too tight or anything either. It was just the right amount of like fit. Just the style of it looks elegant, classy and I feel like you can dress this up, you can dress it down. These shoes actually cost um, $670 plus tax. These are really worth it. I could tell that these will like last for a long time. But the only thing I'm worried about is um, the soles obviously getting like dark and um, from wear and tear and just from feet sweat and just from life. But I just know this will last me a good couple years for sure. Or maybe like more than that for sure. And I think this unboxing completes it for this vlog. So thank you so much for making it to the end of this video. And don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to like. You don't have to comment, but don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you. Bye. This town's so lame. I'm feeling so